Hi guys, it's Becky at Babes in Hairland. Today we're excited to share this triple twist bun hairstyle with you. Um, she has got freshly showered hair so it's pretty damp still. And then we have parted the hair out on the crown into a rectangular section. Um, it is offset though, it's over on the left side of her head more. And then we've gathered all the remaining hair into a tight ponytail kind of off on the left side of her head. Then you're going to be working with this section of hair to begin with and you're gonna to wanna to divide it into three even sections. And again, wet or damp hair will help with this to cut down on the flyaways. But divide this into three even sections. And then if you want, um, you can clip these off to keep them apart from each other. I just put a little clip in this middle section and it does just fine. Uh, this style is great for school, for church, for sports. It's really versatile. I love it for that reason. Um, we actually did a style very similar to this several years ago on my oldest daughter. But it was just a picture tutorial, so as time goes on we kind of like to add some of these um, into our video collection. So for starters, you're going to divide this section of hair into two pieces, twist it to the right and pass that right one over the left one. And that's how you make a rope twist. We can uh, link a rope twist video that's a little bit slower and up close than this, but for time's sake, we're obviously speeding this up, but you're going to make this rope braid, rope twist, all the way down to the end and secure it with an elastic. And then I just kind of clip it to the ponytail to keep it from getting in the way and unwinding at all. So then you're gonna repeat the same process, make another rope twist in this middle section and uh, secure the end with an elastic. Now you could do little micro braids with these. You could do a combination of twists and braids, whatever your preference, but I just love the, the look that the twists give. So up here on the front section, again, make a rope twist. And as you're going, if you find that the ends are drier, uh, feel free to spray them with water so that you keep those flyaways down and that the hairstyle is really neat and tidy. Secure that last twist with another clear elastic and then you will take the three twists and angle them back towards that ponytail. Uh, make sure they're pretty tight. You don't want these to be totally drapey um, and loose. You want them securely anchored to your ponytail so with another clear elastic combine those three onto your ponytail. Now you could leave it at this point but we wanted to put this up into a bun. So divide the ponytail into three even sections, keeping uh, one of the twists on each of those straight sections of hair. And the fun part about this is now you begin to braid it and you keep those twists on top of the braid so that they peek through and it gives a little bit of uh, texture and dimension to your braid. So braid all the way down to the end and secure it with another clear elastic and then you should have a braid like this. And again, you could leave it at this point as well. Very pretty and looks great with those twists into the braid. But we're gonna wrap it up into a bun, keeping it low at the nape of her neck and trying to keep it so you can see those twists. Um, if those little elastics from your twists poke through, just kind of mess with the hair and they'll get hidden within the bun. And then just secure this as needed with bobby pins until um, it is secure on the head that it's not gonna fall off well, fall out. <laughs> and that's really all there is to this style. So we'll share some pictures here at the end of the finished product. Please comment and let us know what you think. So sorry about not posting last week. Um, we've been having some bad luck here at our house. My camera died and my Mac died. So um, we're having to replace the camera. So I apologize this was shot on my phone. Um, and my Mac is finally back from the shop. So. Bear with us as we're trying to limp along here for a little bit and uh, figure things out. So thanks so much for watching and here's a fun picture side by side of when I did this a couple years ago on my oldest daughter and comparing today's styles. So comment and let us know which one you think is better. Um, I like today's because the twists run through the bun more. So anyway, again, thanks again for watching and we'll see you again next time. Bye bye.